if you can do something to help a massive number of people, you can get a lot of money. You know, you you want a secret to make a lot of money? Please tell me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, you know what? I, I know we talked about this off air. You live very modestly, and I like that about you. And that you, people who make money fast, especially when they're young, and this is a broad statement, they can let it get to their head. They go and buy expensive things. They go and upgrade everything. They just go buy, 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 thinking that the money will always be there. And I, I love your attitude about this. And you told me right before, you know, this is kind of unpredictable. You just don't know what's going to happen, so it would not be wise to go crazy and spend that money. So, what have you done with the money you've earned? I plan it very well, to be honest.、Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And、um, I thought, have you heard of Jim Rohn? Yes, of course. Yeah, and he gave a brilliant lecture on what to do with money. There's a lot of intricacies to it, and I would suggest everybody to watch all of his lectures on YouTube. There's a lecture which is four or five hours, create the best life or something like that.、Mm -hmm. It's a wonderful lecture, and what he said was,、um, don't spend more than seventy percent of your income. Ten percent of your income should should be towards the help of the society and contribution towards the society. Ten percent should be active investment and ten percent passive investment, like stocks, mutual funds, and、uh, fixed deposits and all of that. Active investments means investing into your business and just、uh, you know buying a cycle, giving it for rent and stuff like that.、Mm -hmm. Now this percentage might be different for everybody. For a person who is making. A lower income, relatively lower income, for them the percentage might be ninety percent. He would be spending three percent, three percent, three percent. That would be their division. For Bill Gates, that would be different. He would、right. spend point zero zero one percent of his income, and the rest would be divided.、Right. So that's what I do. And there are few couple rules that everybody can look up online. I'm not a money <clears> expert.、Uh, couple rules. Save before you spend. Invest、mm. before you spend. Simple things like that. That's not complicated. If you always put aside a certain percentage before spending, then you would never get into debt. You would never get into trouble. Mark, you see why he's so attractive to my wife now, Mark. You can see that. Twenty-three years old. You know what happened? I was making money. I was buying toys, comics. Like, let me buy. I was buying stuff I'd even want. So that's a little thing, and、yeah. I was about to tell you the secret of making money. Please. And it is something that I learned later, and it's it's so applicable to you, to me, and to a lot of people. And that is、uh, from Zig Ziglar. I also watched a lot of his classes, and he said like, "Here's the philosophy I've built my life on, my career on. You can have everything in life you want if you'll just help enough other people get what they want. That's true in your personal life. It's true in your family life." It's true in your corporate life. If you can do something to help a massive number of people, you can get a lot of money. Yeah, that's easy. You don't have to worry about where you're getting the money from. You don't have to worry about manipulating them into paying. You just simply help them without expecting anything at all, and you'll get it. Absolutely. <laughs>